put inside the guacamole? Well so far uh, I put in some red onion which I chopped really fine because I think red onion like it gets all up in your breath you right, know right. and it also like every time you like do anything for the rest of the day you taste it mm -hmm. so I found that like but I also really like it you know so right. I found that the best thing to do is if you chop it up really fine so that by the time it gets in your mouth you don't have to chew on it uh, it's just like there right. you know it's like uh, the essence of it is there, then it's better. And then I put uh, a couple avocados. Hi, this is the actual part of the recipe where Zach is loading up the bowl with these fresh avocado. And I love mimicking uh, Zach Booth and his recipe that he has stolen from his father. I am not Zach Booth's father <laughs> in regards to the guacamole. So we're loading that up in there. For those of you who don't know how to cut them open, what I usually do is I just go down the middle, cutting around the seed or down as close to the seed as possible. And then you just sort of spoon them out. See? You spoon that out of there. And you just peel it out. And um, it's going to be really tasty. Mm -hmm. And uh, some finely diced jalapeno. Took the seeds out because, you know, I didn't want it to be too hot. Right. And now I'm just cutting up a little more tomato. The seeds in jalapeno make them hotter? That's what's like the really, like the hot Oh, I had pepper. no idea. So if you take the seeds out, you know, you, you wash the pepper and take the seeds out. That's really the best thing to do. Oh, so okay. that you end up, you know, you don't hurt anybody. <laughs> I didn't know who we were dealing with. Hey, look who's look who's here. Hi. It's, it's Robert Dean. I'm fat. <laughs> no, Robert is greedy too. Robert has never been on an episode of It's Time to Eat. But I've eaten all the food. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm asking him to sort of walk through and just say hi to everybody. Can you say hi Robert? Robert? Hi. Robert and Elizabeth don't speak. They're from different planets. <laughs> Thank you, Robert. Get lost. Like, you know, guacamole is one of those things. First of all, everybody makes the best guacamole. Right. Everybody's father made the best guacamole <laughs> if they had them. You know, like, everyone knows somebody that does it right. Right. You know, my dad makes the best guacamole. Right. Hands down. Right. But, you know, I'm not going to get into a fight with someone about it. Well, I don't blame you. Don't I'm, fight. I'm just going to, like, make better guacamole with it. She is helping scoop in more of the delicious ingredients uh, that go into the salon uh, <laughs> into the guacamole. Uh, we have uh, off, off uh, camera some of our help uh, and friends uh, cutting up the cilantro and we're gonna be adding it in. And uh, let's just continue to add the main ingredient, which of course, is the avocado, <laughs> the El Salvadorian, no? the El Salvadorian, the El Avocado. In addition to the final aspect of the guacamole, I am doing my salsa that I love, and I have put that together um, in this container here. I will walk you through putting together my salsa in another episode, but that's part of it. That's the foundation of my salsa. And it's so good. And it's time to eat right now. 
I'm here in my apartment with Heather and DeAndre. And we chopped up some avocado, some tomato, some red onion, some cilantro, Ooh. which you have to clean because it's dirty. Uh, some lime and some jalapeno and some salt. And we mix it all together. And now it's time to eat. Oh, wow, that's beautiful. Yummy. We are here at the Three Amigos. El Salvador, Robert D, and me. We're going to eat this in our mouth. Everybody, ready? We're going to do a chip toast. Yeah, we're going to do a chip toast. Here's a toast to Zach Booth and our friends in New York. Thank you. Time to Hello. I'm DeAndre. And I'm Zach. We're glad to see you. I don't see anyone. Goodbye. Goodbye. To who? <laughs> That's good. That's good, man. Him? You're a great straight man, too. No pun. Well, yeah. <laughs> Certainly. Hello.